If I were a pigeon, I would then lay an egg and incubate it and we would have a family. So since he is bonded to me and sees me as his mate, he will bring me nesting material to my bed because he knows that's my nest and then expects me to build a nest out of it. I call him Chicken as a nickname. He bothers the chickens. I think he gets jealous of other people spending time with me and animals. Like, he wants me all to himself and has to be around me all the time. I can't leave the room or he'll follow me. Pretty protective of me since he sees me as his mate. When I take him to my parents' house or when my parents come over and they try to pet him, he will peck them. He does make like a low cooing sound to let me know that he wants some attention or pets. Sometimes when he's building a nest, he'll bring me random things from all over the house. So like ponytails and receipts and like charging cords or string, anything he can find that he think will make a good nest, he'll bring it to me. Pigeons can bond to people. They like pigeon shaped things. Like most pigeons have a thing for feet, human feet. They think they're pigeon shaped and so they like them. When he wakes up, he starts cooing for me to come let him out of his cage. And then when I get up, I let him out and he flies around the house once. And then he poops in the middle of the floor. And um, then he follows me to my bedroom where I do crafts or draw, watch a movie or anything. And then at the end of the day, we he hangs out in the bathroom while I get ready for bed at night. And then I put him away and I go to bed. Oh, I think one time we napped together. I think he just hangs out with me. That would be for a day where I don't work. I have a cat. They get along pretty well. Well, at first, when I brought the cat home, I got her as a kitten so that they could like grow up together and she wouldn't try to eat him and at first he would try to peck her all the time and chase her and stuff but she never ever fought back she never hurt him or anything my cat tiptoe she would like to play with him sometimes like she would another cat it's okay to have one pigeon as long as it's bonded to you because they're flock birds and they need like a lot of your time. You gotta spend a lot of time with them. So he's out whenever I'm home and awake and he just hangs out with me and asks for pets and stuff and makes a nest for me and stuff like that. But he usually will get annoyed if I stop petting him. So that doesn't usually work. And so like if I stop petting him, he'll start cooing and spinning in circles and stuff trying to get my attention and that'll wake me up. The sound that he's making now is he's trying to get me to come pet him.